I wish I knew. Welcome back to My Husband is My Best Friend. Kel Mitchell and wife Asia talk about how their friendship developed into marriage. Hey, y'all. I said, that's going to be a house party. Yeah. Waiting on Trey. Um, but I want to be uh, respectful of your time. And I thought it to be important for all of us to get on and just tell everybody what they're going to be expecting for this conference. Hang on one second. Let me get my brother. Oh, I thought that was him. It's not him yet. Um, but so... We're doing May 18th, a conference right here in Glendale, California, and it's a relationship conference, but it's not just relationship um, for like romantic relationship, it's family, friendships, business, romantic relationships, and all of the above, right? Hang on one second. There's Dre. Hold on, y'all. Let me bring him in. Um, <laughs> I didn't know you could have as many people on live. I didn't right. know. Hey. Literally, Asia. Asia. Going up. be sure going up. to like, <laughs> share, and subscribe. Asia. Hey, girl, hey. Can you? Hey. <laughs> so, real quick, uh, as Dre is coming on, I want each of you to take a moment and just kind of like introduce yourself to everybody that's going to be coming on. Yo, 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 what's up, y'all? Uh, Kel, Asia here. You're going to see us looking back. Cause our kids are here. We have two toddlers that are running around in the back. So if you see us doing this, we're just seeing what they do. Um, but uh, but yeah, this is gonna be a blessed time. I'm here, you know, with my baby, and we just gonna be giving advice, uh, whatever questions y'all might have. We love the Lord and we love one another, uh, and we're gonna jump our relationship with God, relationship, uh, our relationship, and just having fun. I mean, you know, we I like to open it up to people. So if it's Q and A's or whatever you want to ask, all those different things at this uh, is welcome. You know what I mean? And uh, yeah, talk, talk to him, baby. Talk We've to been him, married baby. Um, twelve years. Going on thirteen. Yeah. Going on thirteen. <laughs> hey. Yeah. Uh, so we know we we've been in this game for a little bit. You know, I ain't gonna say we know everything because we're constantly learning things yes. about each other and about being married and um, being one every single day. Mm -hmm. um, so for anybody out there that has questions about that and as well as how does your how does your marriage maybe change once you add little kids to the mix, it, it's a drastic tug and pull constantly every day. But um, we have a lot of things that we've learned along the way that we can share yeah. relationship wise with us, relationship with your young children, relationship with with friends and just, you know, everybody around you. So I'm, I'm excited to share. To share? <laughs> if we gonna bring the lituation, no, we, gonna bring, we gonna bring it, it's so <laughs> we, we, we gonna be in there like this. <laughs> we, we, we gonna be in there like, like this. Like this. Okay. <laughs> we started going to be in there like this. Like, oh, I'm gonna right now, me and Janella gonna have a crib walk battle. No, I'm just joking. <laughs> going down, we heard the podcast. <laughs> for sure, let me say that for all of you that will be in the building, there will be a crib walk back going oh. down. Who going to win? Who y'all got? Who y'all got? Who y'all got? <laughs> what does it say? Kill has all us drinking orange sodas. Kill. Kill going to have the orange soda on deck. <laughs> Orange electrolytes, because right. you know I work out. So. Okay. okay. <laughs> Something healthy. Okay. <laughs> so I have a question. Someone says, my question is for Kel and Wifey. How did y'all know that each other was the one you wanted to build a family legacy with? Ooh, um, that's a good question. Um, same as you, uh, Danella and, and your fiance. Uh, this is, uh, I've been married before and that didn't work out and all that stuff like that. Then I started dating and all doing all those different things. And then the Lord said, hey, look, I need you to have a relationship with me and be <clears throat> the man that I need you to be so I can give you the queen that you need to get. You know what I mean? And so I started to do that where I really started focusing on him and within that process, 
he sent me my uh, my beautiful wife. You know what I mean? And we started off as friends at first, uh, which was super awesome. And uh, we'll tell you the whole story at on the, the 18th. on the eighteenth because it's really a real story. <laughs> but I'll do the I'll do the real quick one right now. But yeah, uh, started off as friends, staying up all night, talking on the phone. You know what I mean? And uh, I, I have this feeling that I always got from God when I was like around Asia. She made me feel like when I was a kid, when it was like just in the grass, looking at the sun, no worries. And I was trying to figure out what that was. But it's someone for you that God has designed for you. And that's that feeling that you get. And so it's that joy that she gave me in my heart all the time, every time that I saw her. And so God was like, I made her for you. And that's the thing that makes my heart so beautiful. And it's just like, it's, it's dope where God thinks about you, um, you know, so far ahead. And because God is timeless. And so he sees everything, you know, and so he sees the future for you. So, um, yeah, that's how that's how we met. And I'm going to tell you the full story later. But uh, it's just been a beautiful journey of us learning one another and starting off as friends, too, because we knew a lot about each other, too. Yeah. <laughs> so, like, yeah. So, so, yeah. 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 And that that's my friend, so I'm over here cheesing my right hands. <laughs> <laughs>